Drake? Drake? It's no good paddling away. I've seen you. It doesn't do for a duck to look sheepish and confuse with the other animals. Hello, Ida. Still sitting? I don't know. It's all right for some. Well, if you like the sound of it so much, why don't you take a turn on the nest? I'd and wipe your web. I did the floor this morning. I'd love to give a crack at sitting on the eggs for a while, but you'd seem so, so comfortable. You'd be such a shame to disturb you. Huh. What about the extension to promise to go over the nest? It's going to be very crappy when the ones that arrive, such as a one big egg in the clutch. Goodness knows what size that jig's going to be. You know, I reckon it might be a turkey's egg. Oh, great. You know, I had the same problem with my ex. Here we go. She had me running up and down the riverbank, shouting Colonel Sanders, and the chicks wouldn't still jump into the water. Great. How do you suppose a turkey's egg is going to be in my nest? Must be your side of the family. <laughs> we'll just have to wait and see who he takes after. Won't we, dear? Anyways, <coughs> gotta fly. I promised the rooster to help him count his chickens. I'll be seeing you back here at the nest.
All right, little ones, Arnie Mormore's off now. See you later. Auntie Mormore, what is your name? What a big world it is. Yeah, far out. I think Grandma looks like that egg. No, don't go thinking that this is a whole wide world. It stretches far beyond the other side of the lake into the vicarage, though. I've never been that far myself.
I'm sure I have a room for a little gobble gobble. Stop saying that word! <coughs> no, Christmas! <laughs> Not again! Make way for the red bandit! Honk! Ida, you really gotta do something about that honk. Uh, look, croissants! Get back!
weeds won't be gone for long, and what harm can it possibly do? Plus, you're hungry, aren't you? Yes, I am. Well, that makes it two of us. Come along. Only if you're sure. Oh, I'm quite sure. I feel sorry for her. How she managed to lay that egg, I'll never know. It makes my eyes water every time I think about it.
bunch of sugar cane animals, and eight out of ten cats who express who express their preference would definitely agree. What are people? Bad news. That's what people are. <laughs> I know it's a duck. Duck. Yes, yes. I know it's a ruddy duck. Actually, I think I'm a mallard. Shot. 
This is Jack Dell from Birdwatch UK. They're doing a special here. This should get us one up on the Morgans. Anyways, um, here's the photo you wanted. It's slightly torn, I'm afraid. And we're all still in very, very deep, deep. I know that. I've been rumors of farming out boogie. Did we live that your son was abducted? Where is it possible that you ran away to escape his persecutors? What are you saying? That's good. I'll buy that. Just to get interested. Hint, I'm killing on here. Why can't you just leave us alone? That's very nice advice he sells. Doesn't anyone care what I think? Sorry, mate. Time to end the transmission. But I'm never leave the last word with the item, just in case the sun is out there watching. For now, this is Jack Dorf from Birdwatch UK, saying that if you see anything suspicious, from stealing magpies to lost ducklings to the old folks waiting to take your call. All right, Ida, it's all yours. Don't start bobbing for goodness sake. Uh, give me this much you put it. 
charge with a double and safe return to his mother. Well, I would have tried flying at the moment. Haven't you heard of the guns? We will connect the universe as soon as the shooting party is over. <laughs>
I'll be in later to give you a dish of free food. And there'll be some food for you, Lobot. And you can lay me an egg for my lunch. Perhaps a brown one with speckles? Exercise. 
guys. What about her thigh meat? She's got drumsticks on her posture. Well, you haven't exactly been a slave to your step aerobics. It's as much as you can do to get all flat with it. Gracious, though, but you're missing your proggy. Quick seat. Go without her t-shirt. Guys, there are the remote. You're sitting on it. Six months on and still no section of the duckling. <coughs> as you will remember from the photograph released at the time, that's what can be best described as a rather unforgettable appearance. Our experts believe that he may have undergone certain changes by now and have put together a photo footage of what he may look like today. Some viewers may find this image disturbing. What? I'm sure he's still out there, so if anyone has seen anything, please call it. Whoa! Yes, once again, viewers, we are appealing to you if you have any information. The number is coming up on your screen. Mama, did you run out of hope? Oh, no. There's only one thing left to do that I will ring from the kitchen. Oh, no, the old woman. <coughs> she want to ring her doorbell? Come in. Quack, quack. <laughs> What are you doing here? Is that any way to greet your long lost fet feather father? Father? I think it's something with the family. He's not my father, don't listen to him. Um, I am sorry if this caused you any inconvenience, and I'm most grateful that you kept him all in one piece. Don't let him near me. Does he even look like a duck? Now, now, dude. I gotta tell you, the sly, treacherous, double-crossing, hungry, no good can I be talked at! Oh, it's no use lying to get Well, hello. <laughs> What's the matter? Uh, another duck? How do you get a pond to go to? Meow. I told you you was a tall cat. Shouldn't you be getting back to such a mother with something worry? Meow, meow. Tomcat. Ah! There's someone Tomcat! Sally, don't get any funny ideas. We have an arrangement. Don't forget! Ah! Yeah. Oh, no. oh no! Oh no! There will be tears before bedtime! Oh, I'd be honest.
direction of Moreland Farm. That's north over here, is Uh, yes. How very interesting. You! Rainbow. 
he won't remember me. And even if he does, what would she want anything to do with a duck like me? Let's go. 
invite. And if you ever find yourself in the tough yard, please be sure to say hi. Well, I hope you find your family all right. And remember, stay warm, stay cheerful. <laughs>
see your father and he might lay a leg of his own and that that might turn into doesn't hear thinking about. Wait a minute. I have a little unfinished business. Hello, duck. Swanee?
words that they would like to say to some very special people. So can I invite the, uh, the casting crew back onto the stage, please? Stage crew should probably come up here as well. This is what's left, 
Uh, I'm so I'm sorry for those kids. Uh, they didn't die, they just couldn't come in. Um, yeah, so there's a, there's a quote, I just listened to the last song, it says it takes all sorts to make a world, it takes all sorts to put on one of this, these productions, and, and every one of these kids are different, um, but what's great is that all of us were saying yes, and kind of moving in the same direction. This chorus here, this, sorry, the orchestra, the music is extremely complicated. It's like, you know, we've had professional uh, players going, I can't actually play this, I need two hours worth of work to actually uh, every single night to, to get it up to scratch. So these guys are amazing. Right? And, uh, too bad you should come up here and because uh, I think we, we missed uh, your little speech from Tanisha. Uh, but come on up the stage. This man needs a serious round of applause. So, extremely well, especially today when we had a number of technical issues. But here we go, this is over to Tanisha. Hello everyone. So, as Mr. Sullivan said, the music is, is extremely complicated. The orchestra is amazing, one of the best students we have in Ishmael, so can we please? But, but, the guy, the guy, who did all of this, Okay, who had the patience to deal with us, um, who had the dedication, okay, to do all of this, the passion needed to put on such a great musical, and the, I mean, a musical isn't a musical without the music, right? Exactly. So can we have Ishmix, one and only, American born, music teacher, Mr. Grant, please. hard stuff in there. When we first got it, it was a bit shaky, but they work ridiculously hard and have done a phenomenal job. So I think we will play one out, just two, as we as we leave. So, what do you want to play? What's in all the work? Thank you. 